Hey there Kinsey Kids. In this video I will be showing you a little bit about the drawing tools on Seesaw. This is a way that you can respond in your class. I'm going to make sure I'm in my journal tab first. That way I have the big green circle on the top. I'll click add and this time I'll choose drawing. Now there's lots of things to do in the drawing app so I'm just going to kind of go around in a circle on the screen and take you through all of them. Let's start up here with the T. The T stands for text box, and when you hit that, it opens up the chance for you to type your answer. You can make it bigger or smaller after you're finished. You can even change the color of the text if you like, and you can move it around the screen. I'm gonna put it off to the side for now. Also, if you click on these three dots, it'll give you some other choices. You can lock it in place, you can uh, move the order around, you can change the style to be a different font like that. You can even make two of them. Nice. Next one down is the microphone. When I click on this, it will give me a three, two, one countdown. And what's happening here is it is pretty much making a video of my screen. So if I draw a smiley face, while I say I'm drawing a smiley face, it will record that. I'll click done when I'm finished. And what's happening here is it's pretty much making a video of my screen. So if I draw a smiley face while I say I'm drawing a smiley face, it will record that. Very, very nice. Next one down, I can click on the camera. Now the camera gives me three choices. The first one is a photo. I can go ahead and do that, and this will just take a still picture of me. I can do a smiling thumbs up. Puts my picture right onto the page. I can move it around. I can shrink it or make it bigger. Anything you like to do with that. My next choice is a video. I'll click on that. When I click the record button, it'll give me a three, two, one countdown. And I'll say, hey, Kinsey kids, I hope you like using Seesaw this year and then hit the pause button, click done, and there is my video right on the screen. I can make it bigger, I can make it smaller, I can press play, say, hey Kinsey kids, I hope you like this. And I can press pause. My last choice for a video or picture is to upload one from my computer. Chances are you probably won't be doing this much, but your teacher can help you if you want to do that. Last thing on this side, the three dots. There's three choices with this too. I can insert a shape. I'll just do an arrow here because it's at the top. And just like with the other ones, you can move it around. You can change the way it's pointing. You can make it bigger and smaller. And I'm gonna just put it right down here. Next choice, the background. This one's gonna be a little bit different. I have all of these choices and I get to choose just one. I'll choose this green color for now, and you might be saying, well, I can't really see it. That's because all of this stuff is covering it up. That is the video that we recorded earlier of you drawing the smiley face on the screen. So we have to make that smaller if we want to see the green background we just made. And the last choice here is a link. If you click on this, you can copy and paste a link to a video or a website right onto your page. Very nice. Now we'll go across the bottom. If you click on the pointer, that gives you the opportunity to move around your shapes or your text boxes. If you click on the pencil, it draws like a pencil does. You click on this marker, you can draw like a marker does. You click on the highlighter, you can highlight like a highlighter does. If you click on any of these twice, you can make it bigger or you can make it smaller. This one over here is kind of a sparkly marker. I don't like to use the sparkly marker because it's kind of distracting. And then finally, my eraser. I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger and erase my sparkly marker. Very nice. One last thing with all of these markers down at the bottom, you can also choose what color it is over on the side here. So if I do a little bit of a green wiggle there, it will turn out green. I can change it to purple and do a little purple swiggle. Very nice. I'm gonna go ahead and click the check mark because I am all done. It will save all of my work and send it in to my teacher. That is how to use the drawing tools on Seesaw.